What's up, YouTube? This is Review Station here, and on this edition of Amory Reactions, we're going to go ahead and react to the third episode of the fourth season of Haikyuu, or you can just alternately call it Haikyuu to the Top. Um, so, I've heard people, and uh, I don't know about that, I've heard the hearsay right now, that some people were complaining about the animation for this particular episode, and I'm not so sure what it is. I mean, this is production RNG, so I feel I would it would be that I would count on their consistency in terms of animation wise, like Bones is. Um, I really I am really not so sure, but we'll see. Um, so I'm really got awakened with uh, Hinata at this point. Uh, like because Kageyama, Kageyama and uh, Skushima, like even though Skushima is kind of. Uh, like kind of doing his own thing and uh, everyone else is kind of up to their own thing well okay Nishioma and Taraka Ta you know Yamchi and uh, everyone else is you know they're do they're still doing just a, just a team thing <laughs> Rolling Thunder is uh, kind of up to his own antics which is hella funny and uh, that's good to see and uh, but he says I'm he like this is not going to be easy for him um, how long are they going to go with this I don't know Hopefully by this uh, episode, uh, the end of this episode, he gets somewhere. He gets a sense of acceptance or so, or so on and so forth. Um, some so, something where he feels like there's is a step forward, like me, like me that needs to take, that has I have personally myself have, I think I may have taken two steps forward, but it's not. It's still uncertain. I mean, there's a risk. There's a thing called there's a thing called risk it for the biscuit. I mean, because this, when you, especially when you have limited options at this point. But he, with Hinata, I mean, uh, different situation because he is much younger. There's still a lot going for him, for him in life. So for him to shoot further, I mean, this is a chance to prove that he can, he can go that route. Uh, so let's see how he does. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pull this, uh, uh, pull this up now, so we can get this uh, started. Alright. So uh, episode three of season four in three, two, one, go. I wonder if he says he hates it because he thinks it's he thinks they're weak and it's just like a nuisance, or is he or are they terrified because it looks like a, it's an intimidating look? It can be, I guess you can interpret it as both, like together. Like you think it's a nuisance, but at the same time you're a bit terrified. No, no, not terrified. Like a little unnerved about it it's just like it's like damn he's a nuisance but there's some bond that i don't have an easy feeling about like not just because you're irritated but we'll see how it goes if it is an animation issue in this episode which i have not which uh which would be understandable, cause uh, in certain situations, like depending on the situation, it would it would it would have to be improving. It would it would it would like start to spike during the actual matches. But right now, there are no actual official matches.
Did he just mini jump? It's a lot of boy oing -oy on this. I mean, we, it's it's kind of a given that he has so much boy oing -oy in this step. Okay. So I'm guessing he can also learn. So yeah, he could learn through observation. That could help. Mm hmm. Whoa, man, easy there. Hmm. We'll see again. Ah, yeah. Just get ready for the next one. After you hit, you gotta keep moving. You gotta keep your, you gotta keep your feet, you gotta keep your feet moving. That's a bad habit. It gets you if the little jump out will get you out of that freeze mode. Like. When after you do something, you just kind of stand still. Just jumping out of it just kind of, kind of will get you out of your that little frozen uh, stance or position. Understandable. It keeps you light on your feet. Doesn't make you feel like you just stop and all of that. <laughs> A splatter. No, not like you're squishing the bug. Split step. Just like. Oh, I think he got something. Uh, yeah. Yoshi's up. Watch, watch Joe is uh, just like this boy onto something. <laughs>
adjust to the Sometimes you got to let the ball come to you. Um, he's already aware of that. He is asking around. He is asking around. He's asking, oh, how'd you do it? How'd you do it? When someone. Pre That's what you were that's what you're so nervous about? This fucking Cinderay man. Ah, uh, well. Oh, ow. Predict the tra trajectory of the ball. <laughs> Just a hamburger? Bro. Copy uh, fast. Like preparing, preparing a meal would be, preparing a meal would be uh, one option. Pre-preparing like. I don't think that's an issue.
Ja. Aha. Aha. <laughs> Do we think of the same thing? There's a recovery meal, and then there's and then there's the actual meal, and then there's the actual meal afterwards. Okay, fine. We got you there. Um, I think uh, like the requirements for that, like you have to eat, like after exercise, you have to eat within thirty, you know, within. 30 minutes to an hour. Unless if I remembered and unless if I'm misinformed. <laughs> I don't frankly rem I don't frankly remember every day. Actually I don't even remember if health si if my health science actually covered that. Or if my human or if human biology actually covered that in detail. Sorry. <laughs> sorry if I'm sorry if I feel a little bit ill informed. All right, so what they doing on their end? Also, what is up with the freaking Ahogas to, in this freaking in this episode? They seem extremely long. Uh, try again, try again. Don't mind. Don't mind, don't mind, don't mind. All right, try again. All right, how is he going to serve? Okay. It looks like he got each focused. But what about the actual serve? I figured. <laughs> yeah. You can't say you guys go to the Nationals when they don't have their star players. I'm just saying, bro. It's like trying to say you can go to the championship just because you beat a team that has LeBron James but doesn't have, Le have LeBron James on at, at the time you were... <laughs> just saying. Okay. Step back, step back, step back. Ah. Oh. I mean, instinct is good. It's still good. But you got to use instinct and, you know, intellect as well. Hmm, that, that look though. I got, so, I got more than one option for a thumbnail here. <laughs> so you really gotta figure that shit out at the last moment. <laughs> This is ground stomach. I mean, 
using your brain kind of using your brain consumes calories too. <laughs> I'm just saying. This is how you. <laughs> that this how you really think of. <laughs> True. All right. Mmm, speaking of uh, Kayama, Oh, there's this guy, this little devil man looking guy, devil man looking dude. <laughs> oh crap, did you say it too hot? Oh, no one is there. Force of habit. Yep. 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 So, Kaguya is facing a wall of his own, for sure. Just, it's just a matter of who's gonna come over, overcome their obstacles first here. Hmm. Yo, the steam coming off. <laughs> Yo, that, that this when this guy gone like even Tsushima is paying attention now. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, my dude? Bro, let me know. <laughs> At least he's getting he's getting the hang of knowing where to go, where the ball where the ball goes. Ah, man, region. That play was nuts. <laughs> that was really nuts. That's one nutcracker for sure. <laughs> nutcracker was fighting me, dude. Real talk, it's not real talk. It's a volleyball coming in coming in the fast. Uh oh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh. I didn't feel like it was it was almost done, man. Oh, 
All right. We're getting somewhere. We are getting somewhere. Now, maybe I interpreted it wrong, but I think the problem that Hinata was, uh, our boy Hinata was, you know, running into was being too, was being frozen. And I'm not so sure which way is good. I mean, I would say stay loose on your, stay loose, keep your feet moving. But at the same time, you also have to be ready to brace yourself to receive it. So I'm guessing the split step is something to, is kind of incorporates, uh, kind of incorporates uh both things where you need to be set, but you also need to be light on your feet to know where where to go. Um, because if you just stand there and try to receive, run to the ball, uh, you just you're gonna you kind of. You're gonna just come out the gates pretty awkwardly. You're not gonna be able to receive it well. Which kind of, I guess, jump to just jump to the point where you think it's going to go. The uh, you know, depending on how you predict it, you know, and, and just receive it from there. It's not. It's simple. Okay, so it's pretty simple to look at, but it's not the easiest to discuss. Or even much less, much less execute uh, physically, but it is kind of easy to you know get into your head regarding this. Now, the execute to, to physically execute it—that's another thing. So, so yeah, my boy's getting somewhere, and it's also to see it. I'm also seeing that the team is. Do, doing pretty well too. I mean, they're trying to practice their serves and all. Uh, even with within the match, I mean, we got. Um, so they're kind of just kind of doing their own thing. Well, it's more like a. It still is a scrimmage with other teams. Just find funny, like how one team just like, oh, we can go to the. We can definitely make the nationals. Yeah, you just beat a. You barely beat. You barely beat a freaking team that is missing three of their star, three of their key players. You like like what? <laughs> what? And it's a fucking scrimmage, like a scrimmage. Um, but I mean, whatever, whatever floats your boat, whatever floats your boat, whatever try gets you gets you feeling good. I guess. Of all, don't get crushed when you go to when you go to actual competition. But yeah. Um, as a <laughs> as a like. I don't think I need to discuss the whole, you know, post workout sort of thing. That's kind of that's kind of a given. It's just that even when you consider what needs to be done, not all of us uh, can really, uh, you know, go that far. Of it. And I'm gonna be frank. Like I've been in times where I have not been able to get the recovery meal fast enough, and the muscles still ache and all. I mean, they will still recover from whatever from the nutrition of what I eat, but it won't be as fast. So the repairing will not be, so repairing the muscles at this point will not be as quick. So yeah, it's kind of the difference there. Now, I can get why some like may not get there. There's also like, oh, you got to drive to there or you got to get time to, to uh, go from, go you, like, or you have like other things to attend to, you get distractions and all. Or you you're not the most comfortable. Um, and and frankly, for me, it's it's more problematic. Some want to be, and a lot of us, and and uh, admittingly me, I don't. I prefer to be someone who has already taken a, sh who has already washed up and clean himself, clean himself off of the sweat and all. And to to and then have it, and which takes a while, which which, which can take a while, uh, depending on what, depending on what the procedures are, and and all and all so forth. But yeah, you just basically you know right after exercise, you know try to when when you with this like try to try to try to find, try to get yourself to eat something uh, as quick as as soon as possible, uh, like whatever it takes, like whatever it takes now i'm not saying right <coughs> right afterwards go like right if you're sweating and grab and just sit down and um eat something that's i cannot advise that 
I cannot say it's a good advisory of that, unless if you're like, I did remember like it wasn't a huge problem uh, when I used to be on the swim team. Like I would like afterwards, I would like go and eat, you know, go and eat something just before, and then I have to have the another, you know, me like a set where I have to do like this, you know, event, this, you know, uh, what was it? Like this is this is my uh, event here, my event here. I, I forgot what their name. What, what it's exactly named. But yeah, it, Hinata is uh, trying to get, uh, get into some, And I like how he and the coach for that last part were thinking the same thing. So th there is some, there, but that is uh, something. Um, as for the animation that people were worried about, that some, I heard some people were talking about, um, I can see where there is some fallout regarding the call the animation quality and all and that really gets me thinking is it nowadays that maybe animators might be a little might be too uh mentally uh held back like even the good ones like where they just kind of sloppy with it now with something like Boku no Hero Academia I can get why it's still more consistent doesn't make the show doesn't make the show better in terms of, of beyond doesn't make the show doesn't make those kind of shows better in, in terms of beyond just pretty pretty looking audio visuals but it's just like the enjoyment may not be as as great i'm not saying that that is probably the case but i mean it is a possible uh thing to consider when you consider when you consider the realities of you know of how these of how these animators get paid and how they had to and somehow some of them and how a lot of them barely get by which is a problem. Now, until they find some way to improve this situation to where we're not just churning out, where they're, where they're more focused on quality versus versus quantity. That if they can address that, they'll address the issues with the issues with animations, and things would go go by, would go um, would go much easier. But I'm no bit, I'm no econom, I'm not uh, an expert in economics or. Or financial sort of things. That's that's not my job. So it's just up to them. Um, so Kagema, as <laughs> as as kind of stated, and as I say, like yo, he's probably getting smoked right now. He's more than just getting smoked. He feel he is lost, man. He is not doing that much better than than Hinata, to be honest. So I would say Hinata is a little bit ahead of the game, unless uh, they're that. What we were shown of Ka Kageyama was not during the same time, uh, but I don't know. I, I would say I would think it's around the same time. I would still think uh, Hinata would be um, would be a step would be a, maybe at least one step ahead in terms of being able to overcome his his own respective wall, uh, obstacles. But we'll see. We'll 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 still be seeing what Kageyama can. What, how Kagem uh, responds to this ad, to this new adversary, or not? Um, Tsukishima, I think um, I'm not so sure how to really think about Tsukishima yet, because uh, he is kind of doing his own thing. I think we will know once um, we once uh, once the next episode comes, because he did call over Hinata for something. Uh, brace for the, I got a brace for whether it's good or bad. I think maybe he'll give tips. Maybe he doesn't like what he knows how he's doing. It may have a have a there may be a little bit of a fallout, or maybe it's something else. I'm not entirely sure. But anyways, this is a this is a pretty it's an all right episode as of right now. We our our, our man is just. Trying to slow is just slowly trying to level up at this point, cause like he the instinct is good when you try and when you're on, when you're on the court. But you also got to think too. I mean, in, instinct is great, uh, but it but we ain't old. But I mean, even ultra instinct like you even with ultra instinct, you still got to have the smarts to to uh, to you know address certain address certain moves and and tactics. You know the placing and the 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 feet, the court and all that, and but <laughs> I mean Ultra Instinct. I know you can just dodge the shit out of everything, but 
but I mean, you also you can't just rely on that either. I mean, but then again, then again, Dragon Ball is way too convenient with the with the Ultra Instinct stuff. But I'm not even going to get into detail about that because frankly, because frankly, Dragon Ball is a whole is a whole different show. There's a totally different uh, shonen uh, shon shonen uh, take. If we're talking about sports here, so which is more real, <laughs> which is more realistic, unless we want to. You know, unless we want to, you know, do something like maybe Kuroki no basketball, which I've seen clips of, where there's some, where where they literally have just some superpower or sort of shit here and there. Um, but uh, I I don't have really much of an opinion on that until I watch the full seasons of those. But yeah, it, well, our 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 guy, our guy here is love, slowly leveling up. We'll see if Kagame is not so sure how to really think about. Tsukushima yet. Um, I'm I, I I don't have a really a, a particularly uh, strong opinion. I don't hate him. I just like I don't really have much to say about about him other than the fact that he ha that he is keep, kind of keeping an eye on Hiata and he is kind of ticked off. And the least to say he's likely not happy. He's he he's he is not happy about Hinata there. Like more so annoyed, I get. More so annoyed. Um, I don't know if it's a good or a bad thing. Again, we'll find out. Come next episode. I mean, mm, I like how Washi Joe is just you no. Know, I, I, did I say his name right? I I do apologize. I do apologize. I hope I said that that man's name right. Um. Yeah, I did. I did. I did. Tanji Washijo. I like how he is just, you know, silently just looking at him. He he only says the more negative stuff that that is just like, oh, like people who aren't invited can't um or don't are not allowed to eat. like don't they don't even have a place to, you know, camp like so he has to go after he has to go all the way back at home, you know, catch the catch a ride and do the bike and all that. So yeah. But at the same time, he is still just kind of silently, you know, looking at here, you know, to try to address, uh, address all these, it address his own issues. And um, I'm not so sure what. And uh, depending on what happens uh, next, like maybe or maybe, maybe Washio might give a few tips, or maybe not. We'll, I don't know, cause he. Cause I don't, I don't frankly see him easily giving advice to a member of a rival of a rival team. I don't see that. But I'm, but I'm, I'm not. I don't know. Cause he is one hell of a. He was one hell of an. He had one hell of an antagonistic role in the third season. Um, although I feel like um, Oikawa is a, is a bit better. And if I'm, is a bit better that did the did the sort of antagonistic role a bit better in the second season because you know the the reasoning for it was a more deep was a bit more deep rooted in my opinion uh, at least from what was presented uh, for Washijo uh, it's fine but it's just not as you know outstanding it's just not as out it's just it's just for me personally it's wasn't as uh it it wasn't as you know how would you say it wasn't as substantial as the one with uh oikawa uh if you get uh if you know what i mean i mean you can uh, i mean i could be i could be just wrong on that but then again it's just from my personal perspective um I don't think there's much else to say. At this, we're just this is a more this this is basically um, he had to just at this point trying to learn try to learn uh, trying to learn different stuff about different stuff about playing volley playing volleyball that he has never known before. Like that would one day get him into the get him to the actual pros, and one day maybe get him. Into some international 
competition and like maybe Olympics, like if we're if we're talking about, it. I don't know. I do not know if that if it goes to that point because I never, because frankly, I I I don't follow the manga. I do. I think I've heard that the manga is kind of on its final uh, chapters. I'm not sure. But uh, don't don't swim on that though. If if it, if it you you can tell me if you did, you can tell me if it does if it did. Don't swim me on what happens there though. Um. So yeah, I, Haikyuu is going to be quite along for quite a long quite a while, depending on how much production ING wants to go with it. But other than that, it's a solid episode. We he Tianta has at least taken one step uh step forward step forward it's good to see although now we have to uh, i don't uh, what i am what i am concerned is you know what i stated earlier what's skishima's uh <laughs> that skishima's uh deal with him uh, i i i would hope it's for i would hope it's fine like it's not some bad bad fallout but i'm not sure but Haiku doesn't really, you know, it doesn't doesn't really, you know, they don't play the drama card that they don't try to stress out the the melodrama card. They don't they don't really, honestly. And that's a good thing because frankly, my thing with melodrama, my standards with melodramas are pretty tight and they, and I they do like the drama, but and I do like drama honestly, but there's a there's a fine line of what I can accept and what I cannot accept. Um, so there is that. But anyways, so that will do it for this edition of IQ Reaction. So smash like button if you enjoyed. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you're interested in getting notifications and updates, just hit the bell icon below as always and subscribe if you have not yet. Also check out the links to the description of the video for links to the other social media platforms that I use, which include my Twitter, my uh, Twitch, uh, my Discord server, my Patreon page, and also my Mal and Analyst if you're done, if you're down for that. You can also check out the other channels on YouTube that I support. But that will do it for this edition of M Reactions. So until then, guys, see you next time.